is that these departments stay together, that these, that these programs have homes to, to work from that stay on campus. We need to be accessible to students. We need to be able to work with one another. Some students on the UT campus are not happy. The university announced plans to demolish three buildings to expand the business school. Those buildings are home to the School of Social Work, History Department, and Disability Services, among other things. Last night, the college community held a town hall with administration, and it attracted a lot of attention. 10 News reporter, reporter Maria Guzman has more on what students are asking and the school's response. Maria? Caitlin, these frustrations from UT's community come down to one thing, the need for space. Administrators say the business school is growing and needs to expand, while students argue that that's a problem they have, they're not responsible for. There is a space crisis here, but it's one that this university has created for itself. The space crisis in East Tennessee continues onto the steps of UT's campus. Students say the school has over-enrolled, causing departments to be split up and relocated to other parts of campus. And these moves will directly undermine our ability to connect with one another and to remain accessible to our students. The school says the expansion comes to accommodate a significant growth in the business school. They've seen a 42% jump in enrollment since 2018, while students in other programs feel they're overlooked. The biggest message it sends to us is that this university does not value the work that we do. We have consistently been treated as an afterthought in their programming and in their planning. In a statement from the provost and vice chancellor, they said the school continues to invest in other programs. They said they're committed to the success of each college and work directly with the college deans to support the outstanding work of their faculty. Students not pleased with the school's communication and filed an open records request. Their request for more specific information on the new building is still being processed. We want to develop you know, effective solutions together on this, but also don't think that the anger over this is going away. The school says that members from the space committee meet with the department and unit leaders to meet their needs when location changes are needed. As to when the expansion will be completed, the school says they are set for January 2027. Caitlin.